Hey guys, welcome to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. My name is Alan from Premiere Pro Tips, and I'm here with a tutorial about how to simply import files into your project. So, um, when you first start making a video, you obviously need to import your files. That way, you can drag it into the timeline and then uh, manipulate it however you want. So, um, first of all, we want to go to the um, the project panel in uh, in Adobe Premiere Pro. This might not be in the top left for you guys. It all depends on how your workspace is laid out. Um, but yeah, it'll just say project and then whatever the sequence and project are called. Um, so um, there are a few ways to import stuff. First way you can go up to File and Import, just like any other um, program. Um, so that's one way. A faster way of doing it is to just double click the project box and what that does is it just prompts the import thing and then you're just gonna search for the files that you want um, let's see I have a few files that I did for some clients here so let's say um, alright so let's say like these are the files that I'm gonna be using for my project um, you can always select more than one too. You can like click and drag, so that chooses all those. Or you can like click on one, hold down control, and like only select. Oops, I didn't mean to copy it. I accidentally pressed a button. But um, but yeah, just whatever way you'd like, you can import it. So like, let's say I want to bring in this one, and then there it is. It just shows up in the project, and then you're free to bring it into your timeline if you'd like. Um. Also, in this project box is where you bring in, um, you can bring in a lot of stuff. So, if you right click um, and go under new items, there's obviously the import option, which you can, so there are three ways you can import, either in the file, by double clicking, or by right clicking and pressing import. There's also new item. Here you can add sequences um, to your project. You can add um, any of these things. So, yeah, that's how you add. Um, videos you have this is how you add audio files as well if you had a song that you wanted to add um, so let's say I wanted to add um, rock the house by Afrojack to that and you want to have that in the background that's how you do it and then also um, for some reason if you import something and you are um, trying to use it but it's like you drag it into the timeline but it's acting funny it might be because it's still importing so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to import another song and in the bottom right here where my mouse is you're going to see a loading bar so if that's not fully loaded um, that might be why um, it's acting up a little bit so um, let's just choose this song and then as you can see it's loading and then it's done so now I'm free to drag that in and you'll be fine so yeah that uh, that concludes this tutorial it's super easy to import stuff but um, I understand that there's some people out here and this is going to be their first time using the program. So thank you guys so much for watching. I just created a Facebook page where you guys can ask questions or you can always leave a question in the comment section and I'll get back to you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Once again, I'm Alan from Premier Pro Tips.